We're gonna talk about the most devastating shot in handball, and that's the fly kill. The fly kill takes time away from your opponent and is best executed off of a weak return of serve. You're here in the service box, 20 to 15 feet from the front wall, your opponent is stuck back 38 feet. So if you're able to take the return out of the air, you're gonna be making contact about 15 feet from the front wall while your opponent is stuck 35 feet from the front wall, giving you a huge advantage. So in order to earn a fly kill opportunity, generally you need to hit a good serve. So I'm gonna focus on my serve here, and the most important part of the fly kill is recognizing it, early recognition of when you might have a fly kill opportunity. So if you hit a great serve that's down the wall and you see your opponent stretched out like this, you know there's a good chance that the ball is gonna float and give you a chance to step in and hit a fly kill. So let's see if I can hit a good enough serve to get a fly kill opportunity here. Okay, so as you can see, I had Siana pinned 38 feet from the wall. I was right here about 15 feet from the wall. I didn't need to hit that shot that well. All I need to do is pinch the corner and there's no chance for her to get that. The odds are always gonna be in your favor on the fly kill. So that's the fly kill. You can't force the fly kill, but you have to look for the fly kill. And when you get it, it's a devastating shot that will change the momentum of the match.